Hi everyone, it's Teresa. Welcome to my channel. Today I want to share with you a recent online shopping haul um, I thought I would try from Ulta. I have never done this before, but as you know, we're kind of limited in where we can shop and where we can find things. So in a moment of weakness, we'll call it, a couple weeks ago I made an online order from Ulta. I've never done this before. Um, and I'll tell you, it took two weeks um, for the stuff to come in, which I know stuff's taking longer. So, but I thought I'd just go through and show you everything I ordered. Everything I got was on sale. Um, and the first thing you're gonna see is the condition that stuff arrived. Wasn't the biggest fan of that. So we'll see that and then we'll see, um, we'll go into the items I got. Here is the condition that the box arrived from Ulta. And I have never ordered from Ulta online before, but it honestly kind of looks like they somebody just threw items in here. Like the box is all banged up, smashed, torn, things just kind of thrown in. So that aside, I'm gonna take you through um, each of the things I got, because everything was on sale. Okay, so as you saw, things not in the best condition when I got them, but um, let's go into what I got here. First up, I got a few items from the Tree Hut brand. I don't know if you've ever tried this, but I got, um, one of my girls one year gave me th this stuff, Tree Hut of this exfoliating scrub and a different scent. It was like island something, and I think the scent was supposed to be coconut. Um, and although it, I love the smell of coconut, but it did not smell like coconut, but it smelled so good and I loved it. And I just, I was intrigued by this scent. So it's banana muffin. Um, I was a little concerned because it didn't come sealed, which I think is a little odd. So it's like right here, but I know you can't smell. Um, I had my husband smell this quickly because he likes banana stuff. And he's, as he said, it smells more like a muffin than it does banana, but still it's, it's fun. I'll use it. Um, I'll, I use this when I, um, do my home pedicures too. So it'll definitely get used up. Um, and let's see, I guess I could tell you the prices of these things. Oh, no, I can't because it's not on here. Um, the other item that I got from Tree Hut was their um, lip butter. And I didn't remember ordering two, but I got two. So I don't know if this was a bonus purchase. Let me see. Um, it says I ordered three. Oh, yay. Obviously, here's what I was after. The Aquaphor lip, um, lip repair. I use this every night, every night at night before I go to bed because my lips get so dry and I really like it and I was out. So I guess I splurged and got myself this. I don't remember what I ordered. This is what happens when it takes so long to get here. So I got one of these and apparently I ordered three of these. I hope I like them. Um, it's the Tree Hut Sugar Lips Lip Butter uh, made with shea butter and rosehip oil. So I'll be using these, giving them a try. I think they're a pretty good deal, but I've never tried um, this lip product, but my lips get really, really dry at night. So I got three of those. Um, the other thing I got that was on sale was this Tarte Shape Tape Foundation. Now we all know Shape Tape Concealer, right? So um, again, this was a really good buy and I'm sorry I don't have the price in front of me, but the thing I don't like about doing this is buying the shade online. It kind of scares me. So I was going based on other um, Tarte products that I have used before. I have a couple of the Shape Tape Concealer and I actually have the Amazonian Clay Foundation that I really like. So I did it based on that and I got this foundation. Um, it's in that really nice like opaque bottle. So it's the Double Duty Beauty Shape Tape Matte Foundation. So I'll be giving that a try. I don't wanna open it yet. I think it's one of those doe foot applicators, I think, which I kinda like. Um, but I don't wanna open it just yet because I feel like once you open something and break the seal, starts to go bad, you know, oxidize. And I think I said this in a previous video, but just with everything going on, I, I'm trying to not just open everything I have just for funsies to show people because I feel like that's wasteful. So I'm trying to use up stuff before I open a new item. So I'm gonna wait to actually open that one. Um, okay, next up are some hair products. And I got these primarily for my younger daughter who has curly wavy hair. As do I, and we've used these this line before, the Mark Anthony Strictly Curls uh, line of things. So I don't know why this one came in this crazy banged up box, but I got a bunch of this because we do use it. Um, and if you've seen other videos, you know I also have wavy curly hair, but she uses more of the product stuff than I do. So we got um, some Curl Envy Cream, the shampoo and conditioner, 
and curl defining lotion. Not wine. Let me just smell. Let's see what this smells like. It smells kind of um, citrusy. Matches the bottle, I would say. I got this um, OGX uh, Decadent Creamy Mousse Coconut Curls, Locking and Coconut Curls. So either she or I will use this as well. So again, just to kind of hold the wave and curl. She recently cut her hair shorter and I think she lost some of the curl. We cut some of it off. I mean, it'll come back, but it's her hair is more of a wave than curly now. So um, she's trying to define those curls. So we'll give this a try. Um, and then I got this. I was intrigued by this one. I've never seen this. The brand is Eva. Eva NYC, I think, and it's called Tone It Down Blonde Leave-In Foam. You know, I have the um, violet shampoo, the purple shampoos and things like this, but this is something you can actually leave in your hair, and sometimes I think these may actually work better um, because it stays on your hair. So I'm anxious to try this because it's supposed to neutralize brass, enhance shine, restore strength to natural or color-treated blonde hair um, with supposedly none of the bad stuff. So let's give this a try. I can't tell much about it, but anyway, excited to try that. It feels, it sounds kind of like a, a mousse. Um, and then I got another hair product, and this is again, same brand as this stuff. And this is Coconut Curls Air Dry Cream. Now, we both air dry our hair, my daughter and I. Um, I think she may blow dry more than, I think we both kind of do the same thing. I do let my hair air dry quite a bit. Obviously today I straightened it, but um, I do prefer to air dry it, it's just so much easier. So anything that advertises itself as an air dry cream that doesn't lend itself to that crunchy wet look, I like, because I'm, I mean, I know some people are after that look and that's fine, that's just not what I'm after. So um, I'm curious to try this and I'm guessing it might smell like coconut, which is a plus in my book. It's like the cap fell off of, oh, the cap fell off of this stuff. So this obviously comes with the cap. I'm telling you, the packaging was like, somebody was tossing it around. <laughs> Um, I don't even remember what this is. Oh, I got a ColourPop uh, Disney Frozen 2 Ultra Glossy Lip. I'm a sucker for packaging and marketing, and so this is Disney. This is just a lip gloss, and it's a, like a, where's the shade? I don't know if you can tell much about it. I don't want to open it quite yet. Again, for the same reason of I have so many lip products that are open. I'll wait to use this, but it was marked down. And it's called, um, I don't know if the shade's called Free Spirit, but that's what it says on the top, so maybe that is. Anyway, I think that's cute. Um, I qualified for a free gift from Tarte, so we're going to open this and see what I got. Maybe. All right. So, looks like I got, oh, how cute. Um, a little Maneater travel mascara for whenever we can travel again one day. We'll get there, right? So I had to cancel on a big trip to Hawaii this summer. So a um, little travel mascara. Um, very cute little velvet liquid lipstick cake pop. Sugar coat cake pop. I, sorry, I think cake pop is the, the um, shade. It's Sugar Rush by Tarte. It's a lipstick. I made that way too complicated. Um, this is... Ah, a little setting spray by Tarte. That's really nice because I don't, if you've seen other videos, I do like setting spray and um, I get one from the Dollar Tree, the LA Colors, but this is a nice another one to have because you can take it because of the size. So that's nice. It's 0.24 ounces. One more thing in here, which is a timeless smoothing primer. Again, really nice because um, I love little things. I just, I do. I can't help it. So I love having these little things for travel. So this looks like, you know what? I know I shouldn't open this, but I'm going to. I haven't tried it yet, but you know that e.l.f. putty primer that's out there? I'm thinking that's kind of this is same idea. Um, made in Italy. Hmm, interesting. So smoothing primer base. Timeless smoothing primer base. So that'll go in my travel bag as well. So that's it. For today, again, this was my online haul from Ulta, and everything I got was on sale, and it all was fine. It's just, I'm still more of an immediate type person. Like, I like to go buy the thing and bring it home. And so, having to do this shop online, it was fun when I did it, but it took so long from when I ordered to when I got it that it 
kind of defeated the purpose of that. And the only other down thing is that just you saw the condition of the packaging and how it arrived. But other than that, can't complain. Um, got some things that I needed, so new things to try. So thank you again for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.